What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So I swung by my local Ross again and I picked up another Hugo fragrance. The fragrance I picked up is Hugo Extreme. This is a 75 milliliter bottle and I picked it up for $26.99. All right, here is the box. It has that army green on the front with the red Hugo writing. Red on the side has that Hugo bottle on the box information on the back so the smaller bottle sizes do come in a different style bottle the cap comes off like this and it clicks into place it stays pretty well on there with presentation out the way let's get into the notes the top note is green apple the middle notes are lavender sage and geranium and the base notes are balsam fir and cedar i don't have the original hugo but i do know the green apple note is what makes this one so popular go ahead show you guys the atomizer Kind of strange though i do have the hugo reversed in this bottle style and this atomizer is really good but the atomizer on this one isn't that good at all in the air though i am really liking the way this stuff smells let's go ahead and spray it on skin so yeah green apple off the top that very tart sweet kind of fruitiness the lavender starting to kick in it's giving it that very fresh kind of masculine cleanness to it i'm picking up a good amount of geranium as well giving it like this minty freshness but the sage is also kicking in a good amount too because it has like this green sweetness going on. This is more of like a fresh green aromatic kind of a scent. This is actually perfect because spring is right around the corner and I can definitely see this being a fantastic spring fragrance, even a summertime fragrance. You could wear this one year round if you wanted to because it is like that fresh clean kind of a smell. The balsam first kicking in is giving it like this green woodiness cedars kicking in as well yeah guys these hugo fragrances are definitely steals in my opinion if you could get it for a good price which i mean 25 dollars for a 75 milliliter i do think that is a good price this is now my third fragrance in this hugo line i have hugo just different as you saw earlier hugo reversed and now hugo extreme really impressed with this fragrance line so far they were putting out some really nice stuff i am kind of upset though because i have hugo just different in the canteen style bottle so it doesn't really look good sitting next to each other we'll have to see what performance is like just different i get about six hours hugo reversed i get about four or five so i'm not too sure what performance is going to be on this one hopefully the performance is good i mean it has the name extreme you would expect good performance, but we'll have to see. Now I'll go ahead and show you guys the Hugo Reverse Atomizer. I mean, look at that atomizer. The atomizer on this one. Oh, that smells good. The atomizer on this one is way better than the atomizer on this one. I don't know if they like switch the atomizers up. It's the exact same bottle, so I'm kind of confused about that. So you just saw the Hugo Reverse Atomizer. Now let me show you this one. I mean, not even close. But yeah, if you want a nice, cheap spring, summertime fragrance, great option right here. If you find it at your local rack store, I wouldn't pass it up. Definitely an impressive scent in my opinion. Again, guys, that is Hugo Extreme. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that first impressions video. My bad about the camera angle. I guess I bumped the table that my camera is on and it kind of messed up the angle. Hopefully you guys can't forgive me for that. I will see you guys in the next video. Have a fantastic day. Peace.